I delivered groceries. Now hurry up, Chris, and don't let her ice cream melt. I even made pickled eggs. About the only job Doc never let me do was work the register. Chris, listen here. I have to go and do something. I'm gonna have to leave for about a half an hour. Okay, I'll help you lock up. Well, we're not locking up. I want you to stay here. You think you can handle the register while I'm gone? For real? Where are you going? Gotta go to the bank. Since Doc didn't leave the store during business hours, he never got to go to the bank. I never knew where he kept his money. That'll be a deposit. That mattress was his wallet. I won't be gone long. Don't take any bills over $20. And count your change out loud. Thick your fingers. Make sure your bills don't stick. There's a bamboo stick under the counter in case anybody give you any trouble. Like who? A panda? Bam! Boo. Got it? Got it. Can I help you? Yeah. Give me the money. Now. Malvo was the neighborhood's repeat offender. He always committed crimes. Yeah, shorty, that's real Argyle. He always got caught. <laughs> and he always got out. See you next time, Malvo. All right. When Shawshank Redemption came out, Malvo thought it was a comedy. Wait, hurry up. Uh, no, okay, okay, okay. Just don't shoot me. Come on, man. You ever notice how hard it is to think when you're terrified? Boy, you don't even want to do that. He's right. $12, that's all y'all got in there? Doc just went to the bank. Next time, y'all better have more than $12 in there. I'm not playing, man. He's not even finished robbing me this time. He's already planning on the next time. Give me that. And you better not tell nobody you just got robbed by Malvo. I'm also not telling anybody what I just did in my pants. <laughs>